yo what's up youtube welcome back to the channel this is Dario Tokim. i hope you are doing really really good all right so today i'm about to give you an epic uh, tutorial epic topic about car matching i mean shop matching a lot of people have a big 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 problem about doing this thing you know being a carist is not about uh doing a car grade creating look and one clip or doing everything just make a look and leave it like that and apply and boom everything's going to appear the same no it's not about that a big problem that people are facing big 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 problem people are facing when they do a car grade is short matching a shop uh, i mean a short matching is a problem that um you will apply a grade from this clip to another clip and then you're going to face as something else or you have a different shot with the different locations but you want to present them to have a same feelings so people know know see like okay what is shifting the car shifting you know so to the group people will discuss about this thing and i will feel like okay i will i will just uh, make a tutorial about this thing and uh yeah actually we're going to uh we're going to tell each other about few of stuff that i'm i know so yeah i guess you need to go watching deeper and learning deep about this thing because it's a huge topic at a lot of things but today i'm about to show you a bit tips about show mating which is going to help you a lot so let me not waste in time if you never subscribe my youtube channel please i beg subscribe this youtube channel is a great channel it's a wonderful channel people are very proud if you are here trust me you know go lose you know go lose all right so let me jump into the tutorial and starting learning about shop matching all right so about doing a short matching there is a few things you need to to learn deeper about it if you never learn about this you skipped about this sir <laughs> trust me you get none uh, um, uh listen to tutorials i've been explaining a lot about uh how to study proper uh, uh what do we call it and how to analyze the footage by using the scopes so about doing shot matching first you need to learn how to make uh, i mean how to read proper the scopes another thing is to choose the color that's uh, very simply the color that you can see if i apply this look look it's going to work on every clip you know go crush or you know go give me a hard time to do it so you're going to choose the car the car the part of a car has to be a uh, a very close it has to be related with the other clip so if you're going to jump into the other clip you're not going to be stressed you know like you see this clip you see this clip you see this type of look it's almost a look the same as this type of look even though it's different a bit different but it's almost look the same you see the parts of here we got a greenish we got the blue tone we got uh chocolate skin tone yeah like like the car the palettes of got brownish so it's actually look a bit similar but when we jump into another color and do a different thing like we just shifting so much shifting it could be difficult because the palette of our sets is a bit different so i recommend you if you want to be a great stylist first you have to choose whatever look which is can relate all the clips i want sir all right so another thing that i want to talk about you see the reason why we learn too much about short matching is the lights and the time that we are shooting and the we learn sometimes the camera if you are changing different camera sometimes we work like that so i think you need to learn about this thing very 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 deeply all right so if i'm going to apply this lot i mean this look you're going to see it's work like this it's different and if we're going to apply this one you're going to see it's work like this which is different so you see this one and this one is very 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 big difference so we have to we have to switch this thing to be into this one you have to be the same as this one so you're going to calculate the picture the exposure and white balance the most thing that we do to calculate the shop match is white balance and uh, exposure that's the most and you see the skin tone so you have to to see that some colors you to manipulate them so to see some color and to change them modify them like the way the your reference is like if the skin tone is brown you have to push that one to the brown pot if they, the i mean the uh the grass is pure green or some colors so you have to change that to be that but the main thing is what balance and uh, uh exposure and if you have a nice car which is a bit related you 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 know go work so much to change this thing you know go work so much so trust me all right so we're about to do this thing you have to uh i'm about to a little bit uh, make it like like 
like this one like look like this one sorry and we're going to see how it work okay first of all we need to split the skin so we need to split the skin so to, to see the other clip how it look and the range of it so here is a knob that way we split the screen like here after clicking here you're going to see um a different option so i'm going to choose if you're going to copy the color from a steel you, you're going to select image so you're going to copy the color from steel if you did this still like this sometimes i do reference that i i i'm, I'm copying color graded from other music videos and i yeah i do i do these things and i'm, I'm checking on next tutorial on next tutorial i'm going to show you how to copy a color from different uh video so how to make it look to, to, to apply that look to your videos how to you know copy and paste the car <laughs> all right but today uh, i'm about to show you how to do a short magic so yeah if you want to do like to take the color from stills you're going to switch that option but if you want to get the color from another clip you're going to select the clip so here it's giving you another clip that you've done from your uh, timeline so this one is what i'm about to to do the copying so yeah but first what I need is to apply the grade and when I apply the grade you're going to see this one is looking brighter this one is looking darker and this one is looking uh, a little cool and this one look warm so there's two things that I have to do in there uh, first I have to control the wipe I mean I have, I have to control the light and another thing is I have to control the white balance and then I'm going to see what more I need to touch and this is how we do a short matching here is a problem a lot of beginners they struggling how to make color grading as pro level youtube itself can never pull up to that level director kim came out with the massive masterclass phase one and phase two which is the first one has three parties and each of her parts has a long pause video having an issue with the car senses color management creating different looks fixing problems how to balance proper your footage shots merging deal with the small budget camera everything you need to know from diving to resolve masterclass has deep explanations if you're really struggling with creating look director kim never seen enough till he made the 26 lats which is has look DNA and skin tone lat and color separations dctr power grade also available director kim really want to shift you into next level have a permanent mentor who can guide you well to your journey of color grading he decided to create a whatsapp group for his own student member but remember to join a whatsapp group you need to buy one of his products either masterclass or loot package now let's back into the lesson all right so i'm going to my exposing uh tools and another thing that i want to tell you you need to learn more deeply about the tools every tools when you touch it acts differently you see this type of shadow i have to lace with the different tools maybe sometimes i can use gift sometimes i can use shadow or sometimes i can use uh i mean hdr so you're going to see which type of tool it's going to work fine to relay with the other clip so you need to learn more deep in deep about this thing about the tools different tools all right so here i think i'm gonna touch a little bit of a lift and a little bit of a shadow from hdr and as well as the shadow from this part to make it look brighter and pulling the comma to to raise my mid tone and i'm gonna reduce the highlight so what i'm gonna focus on is this this scopes you see before it was like a little bit dark or it was down over there so now when i raise i i beat pushing into this level so you can see it's a little bit we raise but not that much because of the way the lot is become so not that much but a little bit close to there so we're going to see a further options about these things so i'm going to switch this one and another thing is i'm coming jumping to my white balance so i'm coming here and checking the scope you see the, the this one is our difference and this one is always so the always is much warmer so i'm about to drag it down and see how it works this is warm i'm going to use offset so first i'm going to yeah i'm going to uncheck it so yeah see so i'm going to uncheck it i, I mean I'm, I'm going to reset and try to to normalize this thing what i'm gonna focus on is my mid-tone as well as my backgrounds to be cool just a bit similar 
not so much but just a bit similar you know i'm close there so i'm going i, I, I i'm fine with my my skin tone but i'm not good with the with the, my, my glass over there so the glass is a uh, warm so we don't have a warm glass so i'm going to use wall part to cool the glass to be really similar with the other glass like this and another thing is i'm going to reduce the saturation because it looks over saturated so now look how similar we got from here to here and look how far we did from and look how perfect right now we are to our video so this is how we do a short matching it's about to and tweak things it's about to click this and this and to see how it's perfect it works so you can do a further thing to to uh to give it a vitamin over this picture like you do a vignette and other stuff like okay let me try to do a vignette in here let's switch it on it's not like this one this power window So, yeah, looking good. Thanks for watching this video, guys. I think you really enjoy the videos, you really end the video. So, I want I want to tell you that uh, if you want to make a perfect shop matching, there's these things you need to learn more deeply. Trust me, go and learn more deeply about this thing. First, you need to learn a tools, diving to tools. You need to know the tools from these tools to another tool, another tools, the next tool, how it work, how it affects, which tools I have to use in what time I have to use this. You need to learn that. Another thing is learning a scopes. You need to learn the scopes. You need to uh to know better about the scopes because scopes has so many things telling you. Uh, which is your eyes can never calculate in perfectly. So scopes is helping us. Scopes is helping us a lot. You know, um, sometimes we got uh, different eyes where we see things like a different screen. We got a little bit uh, different uh, calculations for eyes. So I think scopes can help you. Scopes can help you a lot. Sometimes you can see the reddish too much to the screen, but it's perfect it's perfect the scopes is giving you a perfect uh resource another thing which you need to learn is creating a look which is a simple when you're going to apply to the another clips it's going to work and fine so this is the talking i hope you enjoy if you really never subscribe my youtube channel please have a subscribe my youtube channel click the bell button to get the notifications in time and see you another tutorial and another tutorial as i promised another tutorial and party two of doing a short matching i'm going to drop how to color gray how to copy the color gray from another shot i mean another video and make it at yours and apply that look to your videos and look the same so this is director kim see you on next tutorial